Hello there, welcome to my channel 1M90 and this is Amit. So in this video I'll be explaining you how to set up the CodeIgniter 3.x application uh, on VAM server. So let us just go through a brief uh, highlights on what is a CodeIgniter and what it is. So CodeIgniter is a pre-HP framework, it's a MVC based system and it's extremely lightweight uh, framework which is uh, fully featured database which has fully featured database classes with support for uh, several of the platforms it also has the support for query builder database form and data validations it also has security and accesses filterings and session management etc so uh, this is about you know a brief overview of uh, what a code igniter framework is so if you are a beginner with CodeIgniter, so this is where uh, you have come to the right place. I mean, let us first set it up. So let us go to the CodeIgniter.com, which is an official website of uh, CodeIgniter. Earlier, CodeIgniter 2, uh, 2 2.4 and 2.1 were uh, a part of a development uh, a community, which was called as LS Lab. But now it, it is official that, you know, from three onwards, uh, we have CodeIgniter which is taking care of CodeIgniter itself. So let us download the latest version of CodeIgniter. The current, I guess the current version is 3.1. Let me just see. Yes, <clears throat> the current version is 3.1. So let me just download it. So until it downloads, uh, so basically I'm using WAMP and I'm using a virtual host. Let me just set up a virtual host so that I can set up this particular CodeIgniter app. So I'll navigate to VAMP and then under VAMP I'll navigate to bin and Apache folder and we do have something called as conf. So under conf we have extra. So if you're not familiar with how to create a virtual host, you can check into my channel. I already have a video on how to create a virtual host. So let me just create a virtual host for uh, CodeIgniter 1 3.1 I'll say CodeIgniter 3.local this will be my server name and alias and uh, I'll name the document root as CodeIgniter 3 so this is the first step to create a virtual host so soon after that we need to navigate back to windows system 32 drivers wherein we have the uh, etc and host and in the host file we need to make an entry so i'll just copy this and say code igniter 3 dot local will be my server name or server alias you can say <clears throat> so once that is done let us restart the server the VAM server so I guess the the zip is downloaded so let me navigate to uh, the downloads folder I'll cut it from here paste it in the I'll create a new directory in dub 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 folder saying code igniter 3 so this is what the document root that I had specified in the virtual host so I'll extract all the contents of this code igniter 3.1 here so once that is done I'll cut them and cut out let me delete off these unwanted folders so now you can see I have uh, pasted the downloaded code igniter 3.x version. So let us try to access the application. We need to give HTTP else it will look for Google. Yes, here you go. So uh, this is how you install a CodeIgniter, PHP's CodeIgniter framework on a VAMP server. So uh, in order to just you know brief you through the uh, 
uh, folder structure of code igniter 3 it's it's as uh, simple as it I mean there is an application folder and under application we have a model and there is something called as views and there is something called as controllers so this is uh, MVC framework and the configuration of the application are supposed to be done in uh, in the config folder so there are various uh, files in the config folders which you know take care of their own individual things say uh, auto load constants database so all these steps so uh, the further uh, the, the next part of this uh, tutorial will be you know uh, deep diving into the uh, uh, code igniter uh, framework so i'll be doing another video for that so for now uh, this is it so we have installed the code igniter framework on vam server so stay tuned for further updates thanks a lot for watching do subscribe and like thanks a lot